edition we are going to be making so make sure you get it what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna be baking it Hello family, welcome to another beautiful edition of Annie's Kitchen and Wellbeing. In today's edition, we are going to be making oven grilled baby back barbecue. So again, we are going to be making oven grilled barbecue ribs, okay? So on this, I have two racks of ribs okay this is beef you can use pork or whatever you prefer but i'm gonna be using beef that's my personal preference okay so i have one of them is still in whole rack and the other one i cut it up okay so you're going to be needing two tablespoons of liquid smoke two tablespoons of paprika powder two tablespoons of lemon pepper one tablespoon of ground ginger one tablespoon of roasted garlic a quarter cup of barbecue sauce you can always use any brand of your preference okay and i'm gonna be using one tablespoon of black pepper two tablespoons of brown sugar two tablespoons of brown sugar one teaspoon of salt or to your taste two tablespoons of onion powder okay two tablespoons of barbecue cider okay so you can always use any brand of your choice two tablespoons and i have my foil all set up for this to keep going okay all right let's go guys okay so over here i have the two tablespoons of the liquid smoke and two tablespoons of barbecue cider and over here i have all the other dry ingredients all measured out okay so it's ready to go so on this wrap over here what i'm gonna do is to use the liquid portion of this first on the ribs so as you can see as i'm polishing it with this make sure you get a good coverage of this liquid smoke okay i'm gonna flip it over so if your rib has a lot of fat on it do not worry about it because once you put it on the grill it's going to all melt and fall off okay so if you cannot remove it don't worry about the fat okay so I'm gonna do the same thing on these other cut up ribs. Okay, so just make sure that it has a good coverage of this. Okay, so as you can see what I'm doing, just make sure you get it a good shower, okay? All right, so as you can see, my the ribs are all covered in the dry spices so as you can see it's all done so what i'm gonna do now is to actually wrap it in this foil okay I have I'm done wrapping the barbecue so what I'm gonna do is to put a little end of this so that the juice can drain out while the barbecue is baking okay so that's why I'm using this type of rack so that to give it the opportunity to drain out while this is cooking so I have set my oven to 350 degrees Fahrenheit and this is going to bake for one and a half hours to two hours i've set my oven to 350 degrees fahrenheit and this is going to bake for one and a half hours to two hours and make sure you check in between okay 
So I'm gonna put this into the oven. Hmm, just checking on our barbecue. Again, this is cooking absolutely so good. Just like I want it to be. Moist and beautiful. Now I'm gonna rub the barbecue sauce all over it. Then I'll put it back into the oven for 10 to 15 minutes at 400 degrees Fahrenheit, okay? So I'm just gonna rub it real good. And when I put it back into the oven, I'm not gonna cover it with the foil anymore. Okay, so I'm gonna be serving this barbecue with vegetables, okay? So, you know, it's good to balance things out. And on these veggies, I have variety of veggies. So I just, um, you're gonna be adding spices of your choice, okay? It doesn't have to be in any order. Just any spice of your choice. So that's what I'm doing right now. So I'm just adding my favorite um, spices okay and I'm gonna give it a good squeeze of lemon juice you know just make sure you get it everywhere just a good here so when this is all done do not add any water to it okay so what I'm gonna do is to cover it with foil then I will shove this into the oven and cook it for about 20 to so these are the single ribs and this is the rack as you can see everything looks so yummy and delicious okay. and as you can see the inside looking so good juicy and yummy okay so again this is beef it's not pork as you can see so it looks different from pork meat okay all right thank you guys for watching another beautiful edition of Annie's kitchen i love you guys so remain blessed I made myself vegetable plates and rib, okay? looking so good juicy and yummy all right thank you guys for watching another beautiful edition of Irish kitchen uh -huh.